Hey guys, it's Susie. I was going to cook some albondigas and um, I decided that I'm going to show you guys how to do them. Um, I got this recipe from my mom and um, it's very delicious. Um, I really do enjoy it and the best part, my boyfriend loves it. So I'm going to show you right now how to make them. And albondigas are mainly like, like meatballs. But they don't have like the marinara sauce it's like I make like some sauce with it so I'll show you guys how to make all that so let me show you right now what I have here for the meat so I have two pounds of ground beef some all-purpose flour um, some black pepper I need some salt too I don't have it out here but um, get some salt two eggs onions parsley and um, wish Worcestershire sauce. Oh my god, how do you say this, guys? I don't know how to say it. Worsh, wor, wor, okay, I'm not, I'm not gonna try. I'm gonna stop right there. <laughs> so, we're gonna put all of, the, all of this in. The flour, um, I put, I would put like two, um, two tablespoons of that, and then, um, you know, enough pepper to just season it, not to overpower it, but just to, um, to give it a little bit of flavor. Um, and then I'm gonna be putting about five to six strands of um, parsley um, minced and then um, chopped onion too and the two eggs right bam so they're done they're red they're rolled rounded and ready to go meanwhile over here I have um, two tomatoes half of a green bell pepper quarter of a onion um, half of a celery stick and one garlic just done in um, about three tablespoons of olive oil and I'm just letting them cook all together right now so all the flavors just kind of just mix mix um mix, mix, mix. <laughs> they're all mixed in there and everything just smells so good yum yum okay so I'm gonna let it cook for about two more minutes um and then I will be adding um, some water in here to so about over here. And then I will be throwing in the albondigas. Alright guys, so the meatballs have already been in there. They have been um, cooking for about the last 20 minutes. Um, once the water is boiling after you make the sauce, um, put in about a tablespoon or two of um, chicken bouillon. And then um, I added about four car um, not carrots, um, potatoes, and um, I added a little bit of parsley up in the top just to give it that little flavor. Um, and then I have some rice over here cooking, just so you put the meatballs on top of the rice. And that is it. I'm about to um, take it out of the um, fire and cook it and put it, I mean, cook it. I'm already cooking it. Um, put it in the plate so we can eat. And I will show you once I have it on the plate how it all looks. Looks a little weird, <clears throat> but it's really, really good, guys. And you see how the sauce is a little bit light. What you can always do to make it a little bit thicker is just to put put just put a little bit of flour in in here, and it'll thicken it up. So that's what I'm probably gonna do because I like my sauce a little bit thicker. But yeah, this is how it looks once it's already cooked. Really, really good. And they have so much flavor too when you once you bite into it. It's delicious. So this is the final product. Um, I have it on a bed of rice, um, two albondigas. And over here, I have to have my vegetables. Oh, those are chilies, by the way. They're, um, I don't know what kind they are. They're not jalapenos. Um, they might be the Serrano chili peppers. And then I have a stick of celery, um, some radishes, some <coughs> um, cucumber, avocado, and looks so good. And my water, of course. Excuse the rest of the table. So I just finished eating dinner. It was delicious. And not because I made it, but it was really good. 
So I hope you guys try the recipe. <clears throat> Um, there was a couple of things that I wanted to talk to you guys about. First one is, <clears throat> yesterday I came across this video on Kony 2012. Um, I'm sure a lot of you have already heard about it because it's all over the internet, all over Facebook. Um, but it's a guy named Joseph Kony, I believe, and um, he has taken... He's doing all this kind of stuff in um, in Africa um, to kids. Like um, he's making them kill their parents and killing other kids, and um, the girls are being sex slaves and so on and so forth. So <clears throat> not a lot of people knew about this guy until like probably today when it just kind of blew up. Um, so I will be putting a link down below, um, just so you guys can watch it and you guys can really, you know, understand what it's all about and, um, support it, um, because we can, probably we can physically go over there and help, but sharing, um, the video will also help as well, um, which is the smallest thing you could probably do to help. Um, oh, so yeah, that's that, and then, um, I didn't tell you guys, I'm sorry, my hand is getting tired. <clears throat> um, that this week I weighed myself at the same weight that I was last week and um, I'm not liking that and the reason why and I'm going to tell you why that that is happening is because one I did exercise last week I did but I didn't eat as well as I normally eat I did eat a lot out a lot, which <clears throat> can really affect me because I don't choose the best things when I go out and eat. And um, two, because I'm always in a rush in the morning, I never have time to grab my lunch or grab snacks or, you know what I mean? And you always have to go and either wait, I always have to wait till I get home or I have to go buy and, you know, go and buy something. And um, <clears throat> that's something that I feel for myself it's affecting me and my weight loss. So um, I went ahead and went grocery shopping yesterday. I bought, you know, um, um, the stuff that I usually get, like celery. I really like to get celery, put in a baggie, um, take a little bit of ranch, and um, do um, eat that as a snack. Or... Um, um, I also bought, I need to show you guys, um, I kind of wanted to do a um, February favorites, which can be a video about my favorite things that I either ate or that I tried on that month to show you guys um, that I've liked it. So um, I bought the Quaker, the little rice cake things. Um, I bought those. They're really cheap at the market yesterday. They were 10 for 10 and they're usually like 2 50 or something. So I bought 10 of those just to keep so I don't buy the other type of chips that I like because I'm a chip person. I like chippies all the time. So I bought those and they're really, really good. So um, yeah, so I, I'm going to pretty much package everything so I have it ready to go every, um, every day you know once because when you're in a hurry you just want to grab and, and it's easier to grab you know it's it's it takes more time when you have to cut it and wash it and get it ready and you know so when you grab it's going to be much faster <clears throat> yeah and um i wanted to say welcome to all my new subscribers um and thank you for the sweet comments oh my god you don't you have no idea how much you make my day it's 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 just so exciting um and thank you for that and um i'm very thankful that you watch my videos it's it's totally unbelievable that actually people like to watch my videos but thank you so much and um i will promise i will be making more um exciting news today too i'm gonna be going to texas at the end of the month to see some family and i'm very excited it's gonna be my first time going there so i'm very excited to to go see and you know what it is <laughs> and it's totally bad and i'm such a fatty but um when i watch like the food network and all these people that go to different restaurants like i just want to go places and try restaurants and it's like i wish i was skinny so i can just 
not skinny, but you know, healthy enough for me to eat um, whatever I want. But that's not the case. So I'm gonna try my hardest to eat well this whole month till the end of the month, so I can do that when I go over there. <clears throat> but that is it for today. Um, why does my hand get so tired? I'm always so weak on my arms. But um, anyway, that's it for today, and I will see you soon. I will try to make another video tomorrow or the next day. Um, maybe I have another recipe I can show you guys how to make and. Um, Tell me how you like the recipes. I know I did the whole week of snacks. Um, let me know how you like that and um, if there's something else that you would want to want me to record or something. Alright, well, talk to you guys later. Bye.